Did you know that there could be hidden dangers lurking in your supplements? Well, it's something I want you to be aware of. And one of these ingredients is called silicon dioxide. Now, silica in its natural state, you probably have walked on this before, sand, is silica. However, as a food additive, it is known as silicon dioxide, so a little bit different from that natural silica. It's used as an anti-caking agent, also a dehydrator, and they use it to fill up supplements and to make the ingredients less sticky. Now, the production of silicon dioxide is one form of nanotechnology, which encompasses taking a material and making it into very, very small particles, and the dimensions are usually between 1 and 100 nanometers. So, it's something that could be a little bit concerning in terms of our cellular health and that's why avoiding these nanoparticles is something that we definitely want to be aware of. Now did you know that this silicon dioxide may not just be found in your supplements it could be also hidden in other foods so things like flowers, protein powders, baking powder, confectioner sugar could all contain that silicon dioxide, as well as even salt can have silicon dioxide. Other spices and herbs and seasoning mixtures also may have this toxic ingredient. Beer can also be processed with silicon dioxide. Now the silicon dioxide is removed in that filtration process just prior to the final processing of the beer. However, it may have been in there in the beginning. As well as dried egg products can contain this, animal and livestock feed. So this is why a lot of you know reasons for eating more of a grass-fed and grass-finished product in terms of your animal products if you do consume animal products, but also your supplements and some of the medications you may be taking often contain the silicon dioxide. Now there could be some safety concerns related to that silicon dioxide and that's why I bring it up in the first place because a lot of people simply are not aware of this. So according to this research, the European Food Safety Authority, the EFS, SA cannot give the food additive silicon dioxide the safety all clear because it may contain nano-sized particles. And due to this uncertainty, the European Food Safety Authority doesn't classify silicon dioxide as safe. So that's in Europe. I'm not sure about here in other parts of the world. It's something that you have to make that decision for yourself and for your own family if you will continue to ingest the silicon dioxide. Now, I want to enlighten you on some other things to be aware of in other supplements. So in this video, three supplements that aren't as healthy as you thought. I want you to learn more there. I'll see you there.